Hey guys, welcome back to Jibber Jab Reviews, and thanks for joining me today and for checking out these three new faces from Sazaz. And if you missed the interview I did with this developer, then click on the link in the video description because it's part of my new developer spotlight series. And I'm going to make another video soon to go over this initiative, as well as another awesome project that I'm working on that will not only benefit the developers, but all of you as well. Okay, for today's review, I'm going to be giving away a free coupon for one of these watch faces, your choice, so make sure you participate in the contest for a chance to win. For now though, let's go check out these brand new colorful and highly functional watch faces from Sazaz. Okay, here are two more faces in the Royal series that Sazaz has put together, and while they both have quite a bit of information displayed, they're actually still very easy to read. And the first one is called Vintage, and it's got large digits for the time, and they're also shown right in the center, so you can quickly see what time it is, even with all that other information around it. And because you have 289 color combinations to choose from, you can really customize the look of the face to highlight particular display features more than other ones, which is a great choice to have both for creating your own style as well as to break up all that information. And this one really does come with a lot of features. I'm going to post them all above so you get a better idea what's included because it's really quite impressive. Now the time here can be shown in a 12 or 24 hour format and for the distance traveled measurement that can be displayed in kilometers or miles. And lastly, this one comes with eight app shortcuts and a lovely Loom AOD mode. Okay, the next one is actually very similar to the previous face, although this one is the sport model. And I think the font here not only makes it look more modern, but those bold digits really pop off the face, especially when you start playing with those color combinations, which again, you have 289 themes to choose from, which is pretty outstanding. So with all the same features, functions, and app shortcuts, it just comes down to which style of font you like better, because with either face, you're getting a lot of value. Okay, now let's change things up a bit with a watch face in a very different theme. And you probably already guessed the inspiration behind this one based on the name of the face and those familiar symbols. And of course, I'm talking about the Predator movie series. And if you can believe it, those Predator symbols are also functional and that they also show the time based on the glowing markers in them, which is a very creative way to incorporate the time into this design and theme. So props to the developer for coming up with this idea. And besides these main symbols, even the smaller ones on the face also display information in the Predator's language. For example, you have the calories burnt shown at the bottom left, step count on the right, battery status, date, and heart rate are all located above. A green glowing dot acts as your battery indicator and the blue dot shows your step count. There's also eight app shortcuts and I'll post the full list and locations above for you to see. And as you can see, you can also cycle through a number of colored themes in both solid and mixed colors. It's a very cool face that would appeal to the sci-fi lovers out there, particularly those that like the Predator. And if you want more information on the watch faces I reviewed today, then simply do a search in the Galaxy App Store under the name of these faces. The full details are also included in the video description. And I'm also going to be giving away a free coupon code for one of these, so if you want a chance to win, then all you have to do is to like this video and to leave a comment. At the end of the day, I'm going to randomly pick one winner from those who have commented, and I'll leave a reply under their comment to let them know exactly how they can get the code. So good luck to everyone, and get commenting! Okay, that's it for this episode. Thanks for watching, and I would really appreciate it if you could share this video and to subscribe to my channel. It really helps me keep the channel going so I can continue to offer you guys discounts, giveaways, and fresh content. And if you want to be notified when the newest video is just released, then just click on that bell icon next to the subscribe button. I'll see you in the next episode. Until then, take care.